Hey, hello guys. Yo. Welcome to Infinity Times Infinity Studios. Infinity Times Infinity. I don't know if I'm on screen yet or not. Probably not, but I was doing all the hand gestures. Welcome to Infinity Times Infinity Studios. Hey, there's You can come. hear yourself. Yeah, it's uh comes around and goes around all at once around here. <laughs> It's an inception. We try to do that every now and then. Okay. Every every week we do it. Okay, good. We're just in that. All right. That's Thanks how we for do coming that. in. You guys on YouTube, you guys on Twitch. Boom. We call you, you guys are Twitches. What's right? up, Twitches? What's up, my Twitches? What's up, my Twitches? <laughs> my tubers. And then yeah. we have our tubers. My okay. tubers and my Twitches. So who's going to win, you know? Like eventually we're going to have <sighs> Man, to pick. Man, honestly... If it comes down to video quality, it's definitely not the tubers, bro. Right, dude. The Twitch rocks whenever it comes to... Looking. Well, I wouldn't say there's necessarily it, that more than as the YouTube sucks, man. <laughs> oh, my God. YouTube goes bad. Okay. YouTube, what do, are you doing YouTube, with your do compression? Us. We love you. You bring lots of people I to I mean, us. thank you. Thank you for thank all the you. followers. What, what I meant to say is thank you. Thank you. But also... But also fuck you. A little you. bit. <laughs> But also a little bit fuck you. I'll translate for my friend here. Okay? <laughs> he say fuck you. Let's go. Uh, in my country, shmaskalaf garismas. Okay? <laughs> Which means fuck you, buddy. That's right. Okay. All right. So what are we doing today? I was, I was clicking on some stuff, making sure that we're e even on here. We are. are we we're on here, man. Are we on here? Are we on here? We, here we are. This is... Are we on? We're on. This is a big thing here, guys. Like, yeah. uh, the only way people can get music, you know, it's not the big stadium thing's not happening anymore, right? Right. Well, you know, we're certainly not going to be in any sold out shows in the Metropolitan or anything like that. So, you know, what we've got going on here is your replacement protocol in such situations, I suppose, eh? Yeah, exactly. Uh, I'm just typing here. As I'm typing, you guys can go ahead and give us a like and subscribe and, you know, like, put a thumbs down. Pound thumbs on up. that thumbs up you know, button, put your, bro. Put your thumbs up your butt if you want. Thumbs I mean, you butt? Don't, butt you don't, thumbs? You don't have to do anything. You can just you sit back on your couch. You could. Relax. Yeah. We'll take over, okay? Yeah. The two of you who are left, the third one <laughs> jumped off almost immediately. Yeah, cool. But thank you for your 12 seconds of viewership, yes. whoever you were. Thank you so much, guys. Okay. And uh, to the rest of you, thank you also for being here. <laughs> Thanks for jumping on early, y'all. We appreciate it. Okay. Anyway. It's nothing so groundbreaking as it's been the last couple of weeks, quite frankly. Do you have the Twitch stream up over there? It's the YouTube stream that's up over here. Okay. Somebody signed out of the Twitch over here and I am I'm like, come on, man. Why? Why? I just So we you. aren't we're not pumping it to Twitch maybe, huh? Well, I I'm not I usually check right beforehand, but right now I'm having to put in username like it's not You're trying to log into Twitch. Log in Twitch, yes. Are you okay. sure? We already had that up. Um it's yeah, not you know, on the top right up. hand corner, it usually says Infinity Times Infinity Studios. It's just uh, got a, okay, well, I'll go check. It's just got a bot on there. Okay, Interesting. so I'm trying to log in here. Okay, as I'm trying to log in, today we are going to talk about LED ring lights, okay? Um, the LED ring light that uh, we are talking about today is the Sokani. Sokani! Sokani, okay? It's it's a small ring light. Um, Dan's actually using it over by ZV1 um, when he's yeah, we're here. Live. We're live on Twitch. Okay, good. Because for some reason, somebody logged out of my Twitch over here. This too. It might be me, maybe Kelly. I'm not sure. But we're good to go. Yeah, so we're tell you, tell your friends, y'all. It's all good, homie. We're twitched out, bro. <laughs> we're twitched out. I'm always twitching out, so... It's nothing new for me. Good, bro. Good. Oh, no. What is this? Oh, shoot. Okay, <laughs> two-factor authentication. I'm not going to do that right now, guys. Why are you even doing that? You don't have to Why? do that to check our to stream. It. You already checked it. You don't okay. have to log into Twitch I to like, check the stream. I like to double, triple check, and I like to have it up here so that we can see the chat. 
But yeah, but you you don't have to do that either. Oh, you don't have to log in. I just got to go Twitch. to my freaking channel. Just right? go to Twitch. Dude. <laughs> That's you don't have to log this, into anything. This guy. This is why I hang out with this guy. <laughs> yeah. So if you're all, y'all are you're probably confused if you're first timers. Okay. So <laughs> let me just explain what's going on to you folks. We are multi-view, <laughs> multi-streaming. That's what Infinity Times Infinity Studios does in our weekly live stream. We multi-stream to multi-platforms in a multi-view, yeah. right? Okay. And specifically this week, we've got YouTube and Twitch going simultaneously. So hello, viewers of Twitch and hello, yeah. viewers of YouTube is what we say each week when we're doing this. And once again, that's what we're saying this week. I feel right? so much better, you guys. I can see the Twitch right now, okay? Yeah, he's looking at the Twitch stream, and I'm looking at the YouTube stream. So if any of you say anything, which is a fairly unlikely occurrence, we'll actually see that. <laughs> we'll see it typed out to us. Right. <laughs> exactly. As if that was the most important thing for us to do today. But okay. yeah, here we are. Here Let's, we are. We've done it. Let's get on to our subject here. Oh, uh, yeah. We have what, subjects. What do we have? We have... Our loyal subjects, the viewers of Infinity Times Infinity Studios, and something to show them. Specifically, two LED ring lights that are really easy to use and will light your face so that you can do a video like what we do without a darkened face. Right. Because what you need is what's called a key light in front of you, and then like maybe a side light or something like that coming off from the side if you want something like that me and billy each have kind of a hair light going each week mm -hmm. right that's up and to our left technically on on both of us but really in order to get a good quality video that you can use and stream and people will like online you need some kind of lighting mm -hmm. and not just the lighting in your room necessarily although oftentimes that's definitely good to use we have some of it going here you'll see actually all over the place but also, specifically lights that are used for lighting up your face in a video. And uh, those lights in a studio are lights that are big and cost a lot of money. And, you know, they're pretty awesome. They have, like, diffusion and stuff like that on them. But these lights are kind of a similar concept. But instead of being far away, like, in a big studio, they're right next to my, like, my face and the person's face over there who's sitting in that ring light. So there Master go. Phil's gonna go over to the other where the other ring light's being lit. Hello guys. And we'll have like a split screen of us where I'm lit by one of the LED ring lights and he's lit by the other one. Okay, so I'm in this ring light over here. Hopefully camera will capture my face. Do you know my face camera? No. Oh. Can you go over there and touch it? It's an S S three, dude. It knows I it. know. It's like it's definitely not in focus right now. Yeah, that's because there's tracking that was on. There's like can't. Oh, there it goes. Right. Bam! What the Somebody hell happened? Somebody touched the screen for tracking. Oh, okay. Yeah, we were we we're trying to find the picture pro profiles, right? Y'all, like, picture profile or, is really hidden in the A7S3's menu. I want to say this for our viewers who actually use the stuff that we talk about. Right. Um, and A7S3 is kind of a new camera, so this is a thing that you guys will want to know about. In fact, you know what? This is some off-script type of shit. Yeah. But I'm going to go grab the gimbal so that I can actually show you the menu, the screen, where we found this thing. That's right. And in the meantime, I'm going to do some little drummings. Okay. Oh, not hold on. You, you gotta. I, I gotta change to you the menu. We, my what, shit. What we could have done is to show you the thing through the pipe, right? But instead, we're holding a gimbaled camera at it and probably shaking a little bit. But what I'm gonna show you is where in the menu system this thing is. All right. So people who look for picture profiles, that's so that you can change the look of the camera, the look of the image coming out of camera. So that image is an image that sometimes can be kind of not to your liking as, as it compares with other images, like in our case. So what we've done 
is to change the creative look of the camera. So let me see if they can see where it's saying creative look. It might be kind of difficult to see in this. Now you might be able to see it now it's not selected. But picture profile and creative look are both within this pink exposure and, and stuff menu. And then they're in color slash tone. Okay, so don't be up in the camera aspect up here where it was in every single other Sony camera that's ever been built. Mm -hmm. Because, you know, you would think that that's where it would be if you're someone who has logic and reason as a part of what you use in life. Yeah, but who has logic and reason? I guess we might be the only ones. <laughs> <laughs> hey! <laughs> yeah, those yeah. are two, two DAWs, digital audio workstations that we have here because we're in a recording studio. Yeah. If you didn't catch the joke. But here on image Badum. quality, um, you know, that's, that's what we always used to have all that stuff in. So instead on the FA7S3, it's down here in the exposure settings. See how it's like a, man, they really can't see that. This is it's really worst. fucking hiding in there. This you know is what? The worst looking shit this is what, what we need to do is show them. I darkened the exposure so much that they can actually <laughs> see it. Oh yeah. So I can now, see it on there. Now I move to color slash tone. And then from right there, mm -hmm. creative look and picture profile are there. You know what? We should make a YouTube video with the actual Yeah, we'll do like thing. a little tutorial of how to do this. But what we did, instead of using a picture profile, we used creative look here. Mm -hmm. And then we, it's on portrait. And then we changed the stuff on portrait. Specifically, we lowered the saturation, lower, uh, lower the sharp, no. Uh, yeah, I was supposed to lower sharpness a little more than that. It might go to one or two. And yeah, sharpness is really something you don't want the camera to add. Um, we actually added one contrast. We might not even need that. Let's see back to zero. I'll give you the contrast look. Yeah. I'm we'll, happy, we'll but no, I'm not happy. We'll do no contrast add, and we'll just keep that lack of saturation as well as the lack of sharpness there. And we hit OK. All right. So then once we exit the menu, this is the view that we have. So if you put it back on the A7S III, now that I'm not showing it any longer, they can actually see the view. I don't have to hold that anymore. Okay. Plus, they couldn't hear what I was saying almost the entire time, probably. Sure, sure. But that's right. how we do here, you know? We're pros. We're still... This is still in the program, even though we're not showing it on the fucking we do screen anymore. Stuff. We do some stuff, man. I've got to move it. Wait, where is the ZV? <laughs> there it is. Oh, man. All right, preview to program. There you go. Oh. Okay, there it goes. All right, let's do this. These Elisa's drums are a lot of fun, you guys. We've, we've had these on the show. Uh, let's see, I played on these last time, too. And yeah, they... Yeah, actually had them in a couple of different things now, right? Yeah. So... I mean, I've played on Roland much. sets before. Like, They're always super expensive. Uh, I borrowed it from a friend. So I had to give it back. But these Alesis, like, drums feel like the Rolands did, you know? Yeah, yeah, I think... Uh... In the past, it was a little cost prohibitive to get triggers that were that sensitive. Mm -hmm. But now they've figured out the ways to manufacture the triggers without additional cost. That's crazy. More cowbell. Mondo said more cowbell. Nice, Mondo. <laughs> I need to get that cowbell on there. Don't fear the reaper, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mondo. Uh, I love you. <laughs> I love you, buddy. Uh. We're actually going opposite cowbell. It's more like a dance. Yeah, yeah we have like a dance uh, boom. Yeah. Okay, cool. <laughs> uh, All right. He's so, got a cool little icon on himself there. Who does? Mondo. Oh. In the YouTubes? Yeah. It's like some kind of little thing that he's got on his profile maybe. Oh. Our boy, our boy, Armando has his own music going on, right? Yep. Check out Mondo Leva music on YouTube. That's right. It's good shit. Some good shit, man. 
since you're YouTube viewers already, mm -hmm. all three of you that are on this fucking platform. Right. Let's see. Let's see how many are on here. All right, I'll, I'll play a song for you guys. Ready? Oh, there's two people. What? There's, there's two on uh, Twitch. Two on Twitch. Oh, dude, it's even right now, you guys. Ah. Get your friends on. It's Let's a, see who wins. It's a race. It's a race. Tubers versus Twitches. Tubers versus my Twitches. Go Twitches. Go Twitches. Go Twitches. Go Twitches. Go, go Twitches. <laughs> That's kind of like a cowbell. What was that thing? <laughs> oh my gosh. That's ridiculous. This is very 80s right here. Right? Oh yeah. Very 80s. See? The, so the the drum set has a synthesizer, you know, a couple pads that are synth. You know. So, yeah, I mean, the synthesizer part of it's cool. So you guys tell me what you think about these ring lights. I mean, so the one, the one I'm looking at over here is uh, the bee's knees. What's it called? Bee's? UB size. UB size. I like it because it has B in the name. And Billy. I'm Billy B. Yeah. Which would only make sense to you if you know Filipinos. All right, my sister used to call me Billaby because it sounds like Philip, you know, but Filipino, Filipino accent, so Billaby. Yeah. yeah. You know? Yeah. So I decided to take it on as my last name's B. I like bees. And item nine is the bee's knees. Is that right? Yeah. Item nine. Yeah. I'm hoping you guys know what that is. So the 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 kick actually does a bass line. Ooh, that's cool. It's got a little bit of notes to it. That's why it sounds so like a song. You gotta get that. What are those things called? Wood blah. What are they? Uh, let's say uh, cajon. Cajon. Cajones. Okay, cajones. They're called cajones, man. All right. That's why you forget, because you don't know what cajones is. All right, guys. Right? It's getting ugly up in here. Cardin it's getting crazy. Cardin again is coming off. Time to take the off rest of the, the clothes cardigan. will come off too. Not really. Haha. Uh -oh. <laughs> Suckers. Strip show. It's a sexy strip show. Oh, we're going to get you sexy. Stripping all that long. Oh, sexy strip show. Gonna get some sexy shit going. <laughs> okay, cool. Yeah. We just do a little like musical interlude with everything we say, you know? We're like the Dave Letterman show and he's uh what was the guy's name? The mm. band leader? It might have been Kevin? A was Phil. it Kevin? Was it Phil something? Phil? <laughs> oh, Paul. I know yeah, Paul, Paul. Paul. Yeah, yeah, you're like Paul. Paul, that guy's that guy's so good though. He's like, oh, take us out, Paul. You know, and he's like, Brrr. you know, but <laughs> he had like keyboards and like. Yeah, man, you're my Paul, man. I'm like David Letterman, and you like Paul. Yeah, let's go, shit. Let's throw some shit at the wall. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Paul. Let's go. Let's bust some shit. You know. Hey. Listen, I'm wearing the sunglasses because I'm falling asleep. My face is falling asleep. Let's take them off, all right? Uh -huh. It's time to get crazy up in here, guys. You ready? And um, I think you're going to like the split screen that I composed. You you were falling off the edge of the composition in the one that you had made. Okay, cool. So I switched our, our spots. I didn't realize you even took the thing. 
Yeah, I'm sneaky like that. Listen to that. About to sneak up and take off production. You know I'm getting another reduction of my breasts. Because they really big. About to get them and man, bust them big. About to wear a wig. About to see me as a bearded lady. Wow, the 808 set has some weird Ooh, stuff. That has a bungo. This is the bungo. I like the bungo. Boom. 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 We got the bongo in the show. Billy dimpy dimpy to. That's how we go. Infinity time, infinity studio. Bonging big and big dong. Bong 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 We drum all night. We drum all night and all day long. Bong 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 bong. We keep it on drum. We keep it always drum. By the way, I'm not saying bong. Or am I? This is what I didn't want people to do when I was a DJ 20 years ago. <laughs> I, I was like, hey, can you not do that? Because there would be a guy every time. If you're out there, man, and you're watching this, I apologize. I don't mean anything against you. Yeah, man. But there was this dude, man, in our crew. I was in a drum and bass DJ crew called Jungleistic Statistics. Word up to my Jungleistic Statistics crew. Word. That's uh, Greg and Lee. And uh, our boy from uh, PA, what was his name? He was real cool, man. And then our other boy from San Antonio that went by the monkey. And the monkey jumped on my shit and started raga spitting. And I was spinning like some tech step, you know? Mm -hmm. So it's like... There's this guy going Bim Dicka Dim Belaka 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 my bad. I'm, I apologize. <laughs> That's my fault. I'm it, doing some crazy shit. You know, things That's get all. crazy here sometimes. That's you all guys. good. We just going crazy. Um, we crazy. That's how that is. Yeah, that's how that is. You know, we play drums. We do. We just have a good time, right? Yeah. We have a good time. So speaking of a good time, uh, what we wanted to do as part of this broadcast is show you these two lights that we're actually talking about. Although last week's uh, stream can also be a source in which you can view the UB size that F Master Phil was talking about a minute ago because uh, it's also the dimensional portal. Uh, I don't know if we mentioned that before, but Infinity Times Infinity Studios is a, in a time rift in a dimensional portal, so we actually don't really exist. Or you could think of it as we exist in multiple dimensions. We exist, but not on your plane of existence. Yeah, it's no big deal. You know, That's we're all. just regular people, but we happen to also be kind of cybernetic organisms once you shoot through the portal it goes to another dimension and right now you guys you guys are witnessing a fingerprint in time of that portal right you're a part of that dimension now but in pixels which is called the internet right yeah yeah you can see into it just like you can see into the future and if you're us but so we've got the quad view going. Now I'm gonna grab the gimbal. Okay. The gimbal Time for a transition song. Yeah, yeah. We transition in. We transition in. Up. We transition wicked, in. Wicked, wow. transition wicked, 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 wow. Wicked, wicked, wow. All around. Wicked, wicked, wow. Around. Ring lights is round too. Look at that. It's round. round. Yeah. Like a town, like a chart. I gotta throw it in. Yeah. Ooh. Get it. All right. What See, are we doing here? So bottom right is the ring light. All right. All right. That's the ring light. <laughs> Yo, right here. The UB size. Okay. You and see my glasses? The size specifically of the UB size is a 10 inch ring light. Do you see my glasses? Okay. Yeah. And you, yeah, they see your glasses on, on our uh, bottom left quadrant. Here, you can look at the, uh, this is our pr current program there. Oh, cool. Okay. So. so if you look at the ring light, this is where you put your dong. In there, in the ring. In the cock ring. It's a cock ring light. 
Wait, what? Or pussy ring. We don't want to go. We don't. We don't want to be backwards. If PC. I, if I hired you a famous lawyer, it would be Johnny Cock Ring. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right. So, so this, that's that's his that's his ring light right there. Boom. Yes. We're doing some crazy stuff this week. We do some shit Boom. with Cock Ring. Boom. Okay. Boom. Look at that. Next time. Perspective change. It's crazy what the, stuff. What the? Did what the we hell? just flip and what spin and shit? Hold what on. The hell is this? Hold on. Let, let what me is see going this here. On here. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I'm Whoa. sorry. Whoa. Okay, flip. Dimensional portal. Oh, no. Oh, no. Dimensional portal. What is this? Vertical? Whoa. Horizontal. We do the vertical. Let's horizon. do vertical for uh, the Facebook. The and Facebook. Then... <laughs> this one for the Facebook. We do horizontal for the YouTubes. I think it's interesting how uh, it, doesn't, it doesn't become vertical. It just... No. You know, it just changes, you know, it. but it stays horizontal <laughs> because of the orientation. Because it's of because orientation. Because Studio is badass, y'all. That's really Settings. the reason why. Yeah. Okay, so peeking through your UB size this week, we have the Sony A7S III with the Sony 20mm 1.8G lens mounted upon the front of it. Damn straight. And that is sticking through the ring light. You might notice also that we have the lens hood on so that any ring light potential could be, be busted before it has any business in the local county jail. Mm -hmm. So that ring light there, although modest in cost, mm -hmm. is the anchor for Sony A7S III's goodness right, right as we speak here. Yeah, make sure not to hit your cock on the lens, okay? Yeah, there's a little bit of a, a impediment potential there. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. Be careful of that. Yeah, watch out for that. All right. So that's one ring light. Yeah. And the other one that we put in our description this week is this ring light, which is something that I don't remember the name of, dude. Uh, some guy? <laughs> cream, it's called the Cream of Some Young Guy ring, Sonokai. ring light. Sonokai! Sonokai! Cream of Some Young Guy ring light. Sonokai! No, it is. It's the Sokani. Sokani. Sokani selfie ring light. Oh, sorry. I can read this description. If I, if I miss it, Ed Topper did that, I am forever sorry. Oh, my bad. Shit. My, my bad. So, yeah. The cool thing about the Sokani selfie ring light <laughs> is it's a selfie ring light with cell phone holder. Selfie cell phone. And stand bracket. Cell phone, cell phone. makeup dimmable LED. Oh. Okay. Cool. Yeah. So, see? It's just clipped on to the side of some cabinetry that's here in Infinity Times Infinity Studios. Along with its uh, light arm, there's another arm that has a cell phone holder in there. So oh, we've all seen this cell phone holder before. So, so if you attach that part to your balls, and then yeah. the other part is a cock ring. Right. It's like a nipple clip and a cock ring. Right. Okay. Now you guys understand, because our crew is kind of gross like that. We do crazy things. <laughs> Sometimes we put the ring on the cock. Um, does this dim? Does it dim? It does. It dims. It changes to okay. three different colors as it's well. It's got color, right? So we'll demonstrate the <laughs> lights functions. First of all, there's your, mm -hmm. um, what do you call the mix of uh, blue and yellow? Yeah. It's like the daytime or whatever, you know? And then you have the, the blue one that's super blue. Mm -hmm. And then you have the yellow one. And uh, that's the one that we use usually. At least I do because I like a warm looking light on my weird... Uh, Irishy face. So, in addition to that, you have brightnesses. Okay. So it's at the lowest brightness generally. So this thing is pretty powerful, and it's uh, powered by USB too. So it's also pretty convenient in terms of how to use it. But it's got like seven, seven or eight brightness levels. That's full bright. Of course, on camera you can't really tell anything about it. But since we're on a cell phone as we usually are with these demonstrations at auto light balances and auto ISOs for us. So it's our best way of demonstrating lights that change brightness and such. And that's what we've done this week. With that that is Sokani. actually uh, the inner halo of light that comes out of people whenever they put the cock ring on. Yeah, this is the demonstration of whether you're actually part of the blessed few of the light. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we're going into it now, man. You can't take everybody into the portal oh, and no. just be cool the with that. The dimensional portal. I can't tell how much of it is like changing in their screen, but on the view the viewfinder screen here on the phone screen, 
<laughs> the uh, LEDs themselves are kind of oscillating between being viewable and then being kind of like uh, all generalized into one ring. No, that's happening in the stream. Oh, that's sure. pretty fucking cool, man. Let's, yeah. Let's we'll do we'll a little song some, to it real quick. Some visuals and a little bit of music to go with the visuals. There we yeah, go. That's beautiful. Filming so, inside the of a ring. The black hole. This that leads to Uranus. Weird. It's called magic, y'all. Well, wow, for a moment there, it even like showed the wood. Wow. Look at that. It's you can see the Oh, wood you can grain see grain the on the, the wood. Dude. I think crazy. it must be light reflecting off the back of the phone uh -huh. and allowing the wood to be lit. Come back to us. You just went through the portal. Now you may wake up. Hey, are y'all are y'all watching us? Are we here? Hello? Hello? Are we Is back? There anybody out there? <laughs> you can you can look. Let's check out the room. We'll Did do we four cam. I think we went through it. No no no, that's two cam. Let's do four cam. Yeah, boy. Oh, oh no, we're going back, back in the on. portal. Damn. You put this back on program. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Okay, there we go. That? Why would we do that? There we go. We're back. Okay, we're on quad view. Yeah. No, we're on two view oh, with ZV and me oh, over man. here. You see that, guys? He's this guy is like the producer and the director and the talent <laughs> every week. <laughs> so. we well, you're whenever welcome. you're running you're welcome, your YouTube. own stream, you guys, you put on lots of different hats, okay? Yeah. Actually, I don't use hats. It's more like sunglasses. Yeah. Because then I can hide my eyeballs when I go out in public. Yeah. You wear many glasses of sun here in Infinity Times Infinity Studio. Right. And then you have a uh, mustache beard um, uh, mask for COVID, okay? Good? Yeah. That's what we use. We have... Facial hair masking mm -hmm. concept. Yes. We have patent. 100% effective. Yep. You can use my face hair for your face, okay? Does that work? Wow. This stream on this, this tablet is like 30 or 40 seconds behind, I think, at this point. Is it? Look. Wow. That's back in the day. Can you believe that? <laughs> I told you we were from the future, Billy. Okay. Well, time. You know, time is not linear here. We Yeah, we've kind of, uh, we've allowed you into the warp, so mm -hmm. now you're all privy. There's a wormhole, okay? You guys There's know a warp with a now. wormhole, a, war a time warp, wormhole, light, ring, ring light. Yeah, so, and the, the way you find yourself back to where you are, to where you started, is you hit that thumbs up. Ha <laughs> ha! Shameless self-promotion, let's go. <laughs> oh. Look how he worked that. Look how he worked that in. It's yeah, brilliant. just kind of zinged the, it. This guy's the multimedia genius. That's why they call him Master Phil. Yes. Hey. Hey. All right. Mask my belching with some drum playing. So what is the magic? Yay! Hey! Yay! This has been a fun stream. Oh, we have four consecutive, four continuous. What do you call them? Four Con simultaneous, simultaneous viewers on YouTube. Hello, Sweet. YouTube viewers. Hello, tubers. You guys are showing up today. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, thanks for showing up. It must be because we are so awesome, and not mm. because we frequently use A7S3 in our titles. Because we're using an A7S3 here in the studio now. Mostly. That's not why we you're watching, right, guys? And Behringer, right? You're watching because you like us, right, guys? <laughs> of course, that four people might be from back in time whenever this stream was actually made, you know? So I oh. can't tell now how many in our current dimensional portal. I, I, I want to thank you guys because um, I'm not supposed to say this. It's actually a secret. Um, we're having a special thing today called Pranksgiving, and we want 
you, the viewer, to be a part of this. You've been invited. You are officially a part of our Pranksgiving today. Pranksgiving is all about giving pranks to the things that we have and giving pranks to eating, you know, substandard food, right? <laughs> I mean... You thought you were going to get mashed potatoes, but you got instant mashed potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like Thanksgiving, but yeah. it's not. It's like rotisserie chicken from the store. Yep. You know... Macaroni and cheese, mm. but it's microwave. No, it's not microwave. We it's did put oven. that in the oven. It's oven cooked. Which I mean, makes macaroni casserole. you can take it to the next step by yeah. microwaving everything. Yeah. Right? Well, we microwaved it probably after. I mean, everything had been microwaved at some point or will be. <laughs> True so that. Don't try to take away our microwaveness from our Pranksgiving. Pranksgiving is all about the pranks, though, you guys. Wow, look at this cool... What? thing that's happening you see how the a vortex thinking is going right around the circle uh-huh that's cool what? can i show the viewers that, that? is like crazy oh, you, yeah you do that can you see how it's going right around the portal yeah i saw that i think it finished oh no it's gone it's gone yep it's gone oh well and we're back that's all right this was never on program anyway yep <laughs> Okay, magic. Is it really magic? This drum, this drum set has been funkified. Okay. I gotta get used to this uh, bass pedal What's here. That? Wow, we were just talking about Paul and David Letterman. Was that on air? That's so David Letterman sounding. Actually, it's a little more Seinfeld sounding. That pluck, plucky bass sound. Yeah, that's like a slap bass. Yeah, like the Seinfeld theme. Kind of. Wh where is that coming from? The bass drum? Yeah. Oh, it's the bass drum. And then they have these... Yeah, I like those. Ooh, uh, ooh, uh. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Dude, we're getting funky with it we're there. We're getting funky. Those funk beats, man. <laughs> well, yeah. I think we've bored all of our viewers. I think that was pretty much it for the week, right? I mean, yes, thank you. We thank showed you, you the ring lights. You guys are great. We appreciate you being we a part of our stream you being every here. week. Um, it's been it's happy been real. Thanksgiving. It's been fun. Don't tell your friends. It's been real fun. Remember, do not tell anybody about us. Don't share our videos, cause uh, then this thing might get too big, and Thanksgiving will be a sham. Yeah. So if you're gonna hate on us, double hate, and you click that button twice. Mm -mm. Dislike. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just don't, just do not, Isn't whatever you do. Is that what makes do, a back to not having happened if you do it twice? <laughs> I'm pretty sure. That's what Gerald Undone always says. Okay. If you didn't like the video, double click the dislike button. Because, <laughs> then, because then it toggles back to ah, not, not clicked again. Yeah, please, please. Like double base, double huh? click. You double click. Okay. All right. All right, guys. Thanks for watching Infinity Times Infinity, Infinity Studios. Infinity, Infinity, Studios. Infinity, Studios. Go to the dot com, you <laughs> know. We got some people on our dot com that you guys need to see. Yeah. Um, that's Steve King, Derek Townsend. We got um, Roscoe's grandchild. Roscoe's grandchild, Ethan Loomis. Got Ethan Loomis. Got Mike King on there too. Right. So go check that out. Got some dank on there too, actually. Got the dank track on there. We'll be back at 10 next week. You guys can hang out with us in the studio, right, Dan? Yep. We're always here at Infinity Times Infinity Studios every week. That's right. Uh, Infinity Times Infinity Studios out! Every now and then you gotta hit your own head. Okay? <laughs>